Now let us write the program to find if a year is a leap year or not. So first we will accept the year as the input. So now the rules are if the year is a century year that is divisible by 100 then it must be divisible by 400 also. So first we will cater to this rule. So we check the divisibility by checking the remainder if it is 0 when it is divisible by 100. So now if it is divisible then we are going to check if the year is divisible by 400 or not. So we are checking year modulo 400 is equal to 0. If it is equal to 0 then it is a leap year. So we will print leap but if it is not divisible then it is not a leap year. Not a leap year. So after this we can just return because we have figured it whether it is a leap year or not. So if you want we can mention leap year here. Else here we know that it is not a century year. So simply we have to check the divisibility by 4. So we can reuse the code here. Here instead of 400 we are going to check just by 4. 